people is me B and I am back here with another video today's video I did mini breaks it took about four hours yeah three to four hours started at 12 30 and I finished like right at four if you want to know what I use and how I did it just keep on watching I've already sectioned my hair in six sections so when I start doing the braids I have minimal hair that's in my way. I'm gonna be using the Shea Moisture Coconut Hibiscus and Curl Enhancing Smoothie. And I'm gonna be sealing it with Taylor Beauty Go Thick Oil, Grow Thick Oil. I have my wide tooth comb. My rat tail comb and a little, I call it a dim brush, but my other dim brush I just don't feel like using. Then I have all of the clips for my hair. And I think I'm going to put a little bit of gel on the ends of my hair. And it's the Extreme Wet Line Gel. This one is pretty much empty, which is why I chose it. For you guys, I've already started on the back. The back is entirely done oh sorry if you hit a chair but now let's get started on the front i was gonna do the front on camera I'm doing a regular braid. So. so far, it's been two hours. It took me two hours to complete the entire back half. So I did it standing up and I actually got done faster. Usually, it takes me about four hours to do my whole head with mini braids. But I've been doing mini twists for like the last three, four months, so my friend was like, it's time to do braids again. So that's what I'm doing. I'm putting a gel on the ends. So
almost done. <laughs> I hope y'all enjoyed the video. Like, comment, and subscribe, and let me know what you like to see next. And if you can't tell, I am loving my hair. I'm gonna try to keep them about three weeks. Usually, I keep them about two, but this time I did them smaller. So let's see, can we make it to three to four weeks? Now I'll come back and show you how they head up. Thanks for watching.